Hello and welcome to Matt's Mosh Pit. And tonight I'm going to be checking out the brand new song Panic Attack from the legendary Judas Priest. But before I get started, I just want to say thank you so much for all the love and support you've shown me so far. Um, it truly means a lot and I really can't thank you enough. Uh, all the likes, the comments, the subscriptions, it, it just means everything to me. So thank you very much for that. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. Um, this is the first single from the Invisible Shield album that comes out March 8th, 2024. Um, I will say I am a, a fan of Judas Priest from a high. I really, like, in the, actually in the, in the last six months or so, I've really started to take a deep dive into Judas Priest. Um, so I have a newfound respect. Well, I didn't, I shouldn't say that I newfound respect because I've always respected them. Like, I've, you know, I've liked their you know, the classic songs that everybody knows. I just never really took a deep dive into their catalog. And so um, so it's not a matter of a new respect. It's just a newfound, you know, interest, let's just say. So for me, this album dropping gives me perfect time to go back to the old catalog and do a deep dive. So by the time, you know, March 8th rolls around, I'm going to be a complete Judas Priest veteran. Um, Cause I do know that I like their sound. Um, it, you know, I've not heard this song, but I can't imagine them after all these years changing their sound so dramatic that it's going to be like, what is this? It could be though, but I doubt it. Cause I have a feeling, you know, I think no matter what, it's still going to sound like Judas Priest. Um, but yeah, with that being said, let's go ahead and just check it out. I've been waiting for this since like a week now. They've announced that the song is coming out. So today is the day. So i um, really, really excited for Panic Attack by the legendary Judas Priest. Right off the bat, it's not what I expected. Um, I'm getting this like 1980s like synth vibe, which I love it. You know, it's kind of like that, you know, the final countdown. It's kind of like, you know, the Somewhere in Time stuff from Iron Maiden. Um, I like it. It's it's a, I want to go back a little bit because I guess I'm missing the intro. But um, I don't know. I, I like it. It's got like an 80s synth vibe in a weird sort of way. So, so far, so good. Let, let me go back a little bit. Why, is, why not hit when it says Rob Halford is vocals? Okay, that's what I expected from Iron Maiden. I expected I didn't expect the like the the synth. I expected that guitar coming in. So um it, it's cool. I dig it. Keys can bring a nation to its knees On the wings of an evil 
Wow. I like the I like the chorus, the whole, you know, it it kind of gives you a panic attack. It gets you it makes you feel that whole like kind of clinched up. Um, but clearly I guess they're talking about the um current state of affairs or at least how they see it in the world. Um, but yet yeah, the the chorus and I get it could be the lyric video too that you know when the panic attack shows up really quick you're just like oh hey maybe I'm gonna have a panic attack but um, I dig the I dig the you know Rob's voice is awesome on this sometimes he goes a little too like really a little too high for me um, but this is kind of like the good the good level I'm digging it so far. <laughs> okay. Um I don't know. Maybe it's best if I don't have the lyrics in front of me, but it's kind of funny that okay, so if I'm correct, Judas Priest came out in like 1969 um it, or somewhere somewhere around there. You guys can let me know in the comments. If if they could see that like you know, however many years later they are li- their lyrics would include meme and World Wide Web. <laughs> it just, I'm sure that would blow their minds. I, I, it's just kind of funny that it's you know, you don't see World Wide Web said a lot often. Um, but then again, it just it it goes to show I guess they're they're changing with the times. But meme and World Wide Web in the same you know verse is is uh, pretty awesome. <laughs>
awesome. I loved it. Um, it was way better, way better than I would have thought. And like I said before, I'm I, I, it's more of a casual Judas Priest fan. Um, and so I, you know, I, I couldn't recite their whole, you know, catalog and tell you what it sounds like and, and all of that kind of good stuff. But um, for somebody who is actively wanting to do a deep dive into their catalog, um, I'm really excited by the new, you know, the new music. Um, so I, I love that. Um, I thought the, I, I believe the shield that we were seeing, I believe that's the cover art um, for the Invisible Shield album. Love it. The colors, everything. Um, maybe, I, I don't know. This is, I, I thought it was great. Um, and the Panic Attack gives you that, like, like I said, it kind of makes you kind of clinch up a little bit. The guitar work was insane. Um, it, you know, I don't know if it's, I, I can't, I guess this is where it's very clear, like, you know, as far as like Judas Priest goes, I can't tell who was playing what, you know, like sometimes when you hear like Iron Maiden songs, you know that, you know, Adrian is playing this, Dave Murray's playing this and, you know, Yannick is playing that. Um, so I don't know what is a uh, Glenn Tipton versus Richie Faulkner. I, so, you know, you guys can let me know in the comments, but either way, the guitar solos were awesome. The drums were fantastic. Um, and, and Rob's voice was at the perfect like tone for me. Um, it wasn't too, too high. Um, and so I thought it was great not to mention, you know, and I know this is in the studio, so things can be tweaked or whatever, but like Rob's voice for, I believe he's 71 is fantastic sounding like it doesn't sound you know sometimes as as you know singers get older they sound a little bit more hollow um where it seems like or they're straining too hard to hit notes um he sounds amazing so yeah i i'm excited i'm in i'm in just know that like march 8th can't get here fast enough because i definitely want to hear some more judas priest off of this album so um yeah i loved it big thumbs up um and now now i have to go back and do a deep dive into judas priest folks um so yeah because like i said i know the high i know the hits i just don't know the deep cuts and i want to i want to learn the deep cuts before march 8th so um anyway Folks, if you enjoyed this or you like some of the other stuff, please make sure you continue to hit the like button, leave comments. More importantly, hit the subscription button. It really only goes to further this channel. And once again, I can't thank you enough for all your previous support. It really, really means a lot. And with that being said, I will see you next time.